Welcome to Home Squad Reviews. Today we're going to be looking on three things you should know about your Chromecast version 3. The first issue we're going to be looking on affects all iOS users where they're not able to cast images or videos saved on their device. Let's switch over to the App Store where we're going to be downloading an app to fix this problem. Let's load up the App Store and then we're going to search for streamer for Chromecast. We're going to scroll to the third item and click download. Open. Close the ad. Select Sean Room TV. Connect. Allow. And then you're going to notice a number of features. Uh, let's switch views. We're going to focus on photos because that's what we're going to be using to cast photos as well as videos. You can scroll left or right, it's pretty easy. Now we can actually click play. On the video it took about a maximum of 20 seconds to download for me. Uh, I've heard it can take longer. All right, that's it for casting images and videos. The second thing we're gonna be looking on is editing the ambient mode. So editing the ambient mode allows you to change the images that are shown, the weather, and as well as the time and the Chromecast name. We will first have to click Sean Room TV, then edit ambient mode. We're going to start with the first option, so we're going to click Google Photos. Now to set Google Photos up, we first have to use, go to the account that we logged in on our Chrome and set up an album, upload some pictures and then they will be available to you on your Chromecast. Alright, we can also show the photos in pairs, so two at a time. Like so. Okay, let's move to the next option, Art Gallery. Now this allows you, pretty much Art Gallery provides a number of options that you can select from or categories so if I wanted to customize this to show let's say earth and space I would uncheck all the other categories like so and you will notice that the television will only show images of the earth from a bird's eye view as well as space. There is also an experimental option that has low bandwidth mode selected always. You can't uncheck it. You can also manage the weather. You can either hide it, change it to either Celsius, Fahrenheit or both. You can also control the time by hiding or showing device information, personal photo data, as well as you can actually control the speed at which the images rotate or transition between each other. Okay, that is it for the ambient mode. And lastly, the third thing we're going to be looking on is factory resetting our Chromecast. Okay, so here's the button that we'll be pressing to reset the Chromecast. 
Also, you will notice that the light will change from orange to white. I'm going to press it for 10 seconds until it changes to white. And that's it, your Chromecast is factory reset. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Please smash that like button if you found these tips to be helpful. Leave a comment down below if I left out anything and subscribe if you would like to see more content like this. Peace.